stuck again. <laughs> I'm getting ready to show you a cool trick. Um, you know how like when you want to go out dancing and you got your sneakers on and you just you can't spin no matter how many times you want to do a pirouette because you get in traction, <laughs> you know, because the dance floor has got it's plexiglass or plastic of some kind and it just you, you can't spin and you know if you can't spin then you can't really have any fun <laughs> so I'm going to show you a trick to make it easy to spin and turn any shoe you're wearing into a dance shoe you ready here okay now the first thing you want to do is either look inside your dresser drawer or run over to the 99 cent store or the dollar store whichever and grab a pair of socks Okay, now grab some scissors, grab the sock, cut off <laughs> the toe part. See how easy that is? Then right where the heel's at, cut that off. You now have a sleeve that you can slide over your shoe. Okay, I slid it over the shoe, and as you can see, it's super easy to do. And as soon as you put it on, you know, it covers the bottom and allows for, yeah, spinning. Okay, now I'm going to show you. You can do this to any shoe, like, you know, your combat boots, <laughs> the ones you really like to dance in. Just take it, slide it over, because, you know, this rubber right here, when you're trying to spin on a dance floor, or you are definitely going to put yourself in traction and you could really hurt yourself. So by putting this over it, it may not make the shoe look as cute, but it definitely keeps you from hurting yourself <laughs> and you can spin real well. Okay, so now these combat boots are definitely ready for dancing. Yeah, just cut off the toes, cut off the heels and instant dance shoes. Twist, twist. <laughs> yeah. Every shoe can be a dad's shoe simply by throwing a pair of cut up socks over them. <laughs> okay, so, you know, with this sock situation, literally you can take any shoe you have and turn it into a dance shoe. Now, you know, if, you, if you're a dancer, it, you, you've already invested in a pair of Capizios or Joe Tremaine's, and you're spoiled by that leather bottom. I know I am. <laughs> but unfortunately, with those shoes, you, you pretty much only want to wear them at the dance school or at the dance studio. You, you, you don't want to really wear them out to a nightclub. And you tend to favor your sneakers, your Converse, your combat boots when you go out dancing. And when you go to the club, you've discovered that all the club owners, for whatever reason, have decided to switch out their wooden dance floor that was perfect for dancing and turned it into, like, plexiglass dance floors or metal dance floors. And they're not really conducive to dancing. So, you know, I was taking baby powder and sprinkling it on so I could spin and apparently it was upsetting some of the customers because they were drinkers not dancers and you know they would slip and fall <laughs> oops but you know so I had to do it in a way that I could still get my dancing in while they did their drinking and not bring my baby powder with me because the club owners don't want me bringing the baby powder. So it occurred to me that with the sock, you know, you can dance in your socks at home. Now, why not just cut off the toe and the heel and put it over any shoe you're wearing? And then that way, technically, any shoe you have can be a dance shoe. And at the end of the night, you can throw it in the washing machine. <laughs> you know, pretty easy, right? Now, from what I understand, at some of the gymnasiums, they have something similar for like 20 
box, some type of a sleeve or something <laughs> that you can put over your thing, you know, your shoe, I guess. But, you know, they're 20 bucks. And technically, you've already, I'm sure, got a pair of socks in your dresser that you can cut up. And if not, you can spend a dollar at the 99 cent store on a pair of socks you can cut up. <laughs> so, yeah. No sense in spending 20 bucks at the local gym for some sleeve to go over your shoe when you can just cut up any pair of socks you want to. <laughs> Let me know if you try this concept. And if you do, make sure you... You know, you have some fun dancing. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye for now.